Hi developers, welcome back to Code Step by Step. My name is Anil, and uh, in this React Router 6 part, we are going to learn about search param hook. So let's start with the points. First of all, I will tell you what is the use of this uh, uh, search param hook. I will give you the example of search param hook, and uh, then we will talk about set search param. What is that? I will explain you everything, and uh, at the last, we will discuss some important interview questions related to the search param hooks. So now let's uh, discuss that what is the actual use of this. So as we know, if we have uh, dynamic parameters, like uh, I just want to get this name from uh, the URL, then we can use simply use params. But how we can get the query params? So let's say uh, here I have a uh, age equal to 30 and I want to get this age inside our React code, how I can access it. For that, we have to use a uh, search param. So now let's uh, take example that how we can get it. So I already created a uh, page with the name of filter so that we can save the time because I already uh, teach you that how we can create the uh, pages and links hello and all right. So I already created a link here you can see that which is the filter and now first of all we have to import something from react router dom and what we have to import here use search param and uh, now let's uh, just take a const and you will find that this is pretty much similar to the use state uh, hook which is uh, we use from the react library right so we can just get these these uh, you can say that uh, constants from uh, use search params and uh, we can put any names uh, for example we can just say that search params and uh, then we can say that set search params set search params all right uh, so as we know that we want to access the age from uh, URL that how we can access it for that what we can do here we can just simply make a let or const whatever you want to do age and we can say that search param dot get and our query param name which is age right and now if you want to make it console then we can do that like age and here we go we can you can see that we get it in the console and same thing we can print it inside the uh, return also so let's say i have a h3 tag and i want to print here age so let's say age is a is constant and we can see that age is 13 so let's say we have the two parameters one is age and second one is city and city is let's say Delhi and how we can get it the same way uh, let's come back here and create the another const with the name of city search param dot get city and if you want to print it do the same thing city with the city inside the JSX and we got that okay right all right so now what is set search param which is used for set the query param so let's say from this page i want to set some query param then how i can do that so now let's see how we can do that uh, let's say i have a button here and on button click click i want to set age set age and uh, let's make your own click event and with that own click we can simply call this function which is a uh, set search param we can copy and paste it and we can set any age uh, let's say uh, it it uh, it will take actually uh, object as a parameter so age is let's say 60 right and uh, if i am just going to click on it 
you can see that age is 16 and now you will find that one thing here that it actually removed the another query param also because we just put here only age and uh, let's say I have age is 20 and city is Delhi when we will click on it city is Delhi and when we click on the set age it will remove the city right because it is actually set the uh, search uh, query params uh, from scratch so how we can resolve this issue I will tell you but uh, let's take one more example uh, let's say I have an input here input box and on the change of input box I want to set some text in the query param so how I can do that type is let's say text and uh, we can take here own change event it will have some value so how we can get this value h can get that event dot target dot value right and uh, we can remove this extra text also and now everything is fine and now let's set see that is age is setting or not if I put here something then this is working fine so let's say I just want to set here text or something not age actually and if I just put here ABC it will actually set in the query param but how we can set the two query param same time so for that what we, what we can do here we can just add a comma and put the second key and value pair for objects let's say age is uh, 70 and if I'm putting here something now you can see that age is also set if I just set here only age it will it will remove the text if I am just setting this uh, uh, query param from input box then it will set the both text as well as age so what questions can be asked on um, the search parameter uh, search, search, search param hooks first question is that same what are the use of what are the use of search query params and set search params second thing they can ask that uh, uh, what is the difference between use params and search params so you can say that use param is basically used for get the query param and uh, a use param is basically used for get the data uh, dynamic from dynamic URL right so uh, dynamic URL means uh, let's say I just want to click on the Peter then after the user uh, we have a Peter and this is basically a dynamic uh, data from here right so use params is basically used in that case that's all for this part thank you so much if you have any query you can ask me in the comment box thank you so much